Hi, and welcome back to my channel. Um, it's been a while. Um, as you guys know, I was doing my content mainly on the bio board. Um, and from my previous videos, as you saw, I pushed it pretty hard and took it out in some not the best weather. And lo and behold, a little bit of water ingress. So I had to send it back to be fixed. Uh, and I thought, mm, OK, perhaps this isn't going to be for me. The British weather, as anyone in the UK watching this will know, it's pretty bad. So <clears throat> what I wanted to do was I wanted to kind of sell that, which I did do. Uh, and so I don't have that anymore. Uh, but I needed something for the winter. I wanted to say a bit more off-road. And I've been doing some uh, research. And obviously, the name that keeps coming up is Tramper. So without further ado, we have got ourselves a fully loaded two-wheel drive gear drive tramper uh, and the biggest thing to say about this I think is um, I spoke to the guys in tramper last Monday put the order in and it's now a week later and the board is here I mean whenever you come to buy premium boards I think that kind of turnaround time is pretty much unheard of except in the tramper world um, there's some really good videos about tramper uh, specifically one with uh, the reviewer Jay Boston and he talks about the culture of Tramper and how actually it's something that they kind of want to keep a secret because it's so good um, and I'm excited to see if that's true or not so without further ado let's uh, crack into the box and see what we've got it's So, with the fully loaded package, <clears throat> you get everything that you could possibly need. So you get a special protective bag, you get a bag to cover the battery box, you get the, their wand controller, which is controlled by a VESC, and apparently it's very, very good, very intuitive, tells you everything you need to know, it looks pretty good too. I think the biggest thing with, with Champer as well is that obviously you can make it fully customised. Um, the fully loaded comes with everything you need, you can make a few changes here and there, but also colour, colour options, things like that, to make it more personal to you. Um, so you'll be able to see my choices very soon. Here's the, here's the bag. Really cool bag. Really well protected, padded. Mm. It's a handy stuff in it. You don't feel love like you did before. Okay, this is it out of the box. This is a serious piece of kit. Now, I think if the title um, is it substance over style. I think when I first started out in electric skateboarding, I didn't understand why people would opt for 
these boards with the top mounted battery boxes, it just looked ugly. Like it just didn't, didn't fit. But then as you get more into your boarding and you want to push yourself further, and then you suddenly realize that actually, especially living in the UK, <laughs> you need substance. You need something that's going to protect the board and, and just be suitable for riding, especially in the winter. Um, suddenly, your idea of what looks good, at least from the beginning, changes because it changes to what you need. And suddenly, this I wouldn't, uh, I would have appreciated it, but I don't think I would have looked at it the same way that I'm looking at it now. And it is fabulous. It's so well made. Unfortunately, since I think Trampa, they'd probably say, like any company, they've um, progressed, got better, their parts have got better. I've got the new AR tr uh, IR truck, sorry, which is, they've just done a video on. They're brand new. Um, they've got these mud pluggers, got nine inch at the, at the back, eight inch at the front. Um, again, that was a suggestion uh, by Ted from Trampa. But it's a massive monster box with 21700. Uh, in it, which is going to take me, hopefully, about over 30 miles. Um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to uh, actually trying this out and seeing how good it is, because it, especially from the back, it looks like an absolute monster. 17 inches wide, the hangers. Yeah, it just looks uh, it's pretty amazing. Um, yeah, and also, <laughs> I mean, the size of the charger. So is that bad boy. Apparently, if it charged it up in about two and a half hours, it's a 12 amp charger. And what I didn't show before, before is this is the small cover to go over the box. <coughs> and this is the controller, which is just nice. That's just really, really nice. And just everything, just a very subtle black and green throughout. There we go. Very, very basic, very quick unboxing. But so far, I think everything looks absolutely stunning. I suppose it all comes down to how it rides, but looking at the videos and looking at how people uh, respond to their trampers. I mean, a couple of guys have taken these up Snowden, <laughs> up Snowden and down. So, I mean, these things are made to last and they're definitely made in the UK, made for the UK. And with a week turnaround time, fully custom, I mean, you can't get better than that frankly. So <clears throat> this is just a late night boxing because I didn't want to wait until the morning and hopefully um, when the, uh, ironically when the weather clears up, but that's purely for filming purposes, <laughs> uh, we take her out and see how she uh, see how she goes, see how she feels. She should be pretty quick as well, I've got 160 kV motors on the back and gear drive um, set up so it should, should be over 30 miles an hour, 30 mile range hopefully. Off-road all you like. Not too heavy. Bit a bit lighter than the bio board, maybe. But the weight's a bit distributed to the back because obviously you've got your gears. Anyway, I'm just waffling now. So hopefully the next videos that you'll see will be of uh, me riding it. See how it goes. Nice one. Oh. Thanks guys at Champa, especially Ted. <laughs>